Aidan, um, you fought recently at September the 19th on the Fight UK Amateur Championships. Um, you won by a very slick submission. Um, before on the weigh-ins, do you want to talk us through how you're feeling and the kind of the aggression I clearly saw when you were in that room? Yeah, uh, I don't know. It felt weird, you know, fighting someone like. I mean, I originally wanted to fight my house in. Still got my hopes up, you know, to kick his ass. But um, you know, it was. I don't know. It was weird having an opponent pull out two days in and. How does that affect you when you kind of go and you're thinking you're going to fight someone and then you're fighting somebody else? Well, it was weird because I didn't know nothing about him, you know, what he was, trained specifically for Matt House and then, you know. It's not something that we've seen before, so is um, the other part of something that you are, you know, you're drilling or is it just, did it just come up as an opportunity and you thought, there it is? I don't know where it came from, I mean, you know, that's probably like the third time I've ever, you know, done it. It was. I thought, you know, the triangle was going to be a bit more tricky to get from here. I just pulled it off and it worked. Even so. before that, even before the submission was coming, you were going in with your fists and, yeah. and, you know, to begin with, I thought it might finish like that. You know, what do you think about that? Well, I wanted to uh, get the knockout of that, really, you know, because, I mean, my last fight was just all ground. No one got to see my stand-up and I thought, you know, I've got to make a bit of a statement here, you know, knock them out. But the Emma Platter came and that was, well, go, go, Platter. One last question before I'll get you to talk through what um, happened on the night. How are you preparing for your next one? Uh, I'm chilling at the minute and then going to hit the gym back, you know. Train hard, work on my holes, you know. Improve. Okay, well let's improve. watch it through and I'll let you talk it through. What was going through your mind at this stage? Just, this was obviously only your second fight that you've done. Just, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you are looking a bit of a monster there. I thought, instructions you know, I'm just going to take his head off, you know. And I mean, it worked better than I thought, you know, he came out. Because on there, you look a much bigger lad than you, so, you know, did that go through your head and think, well, I thought, physically, you know, he's going to be a bit more stronger. I mean, I feel I'm, you know, very strong for my weight, but I thought, you know, I'm just going to... What are we doing here? Just kind of thinking, what are you doing, judging you? Working off, working my boxing a little bit. Could have thought through way more kicks. You know, I don't feel right now. Yeah. Jamie's got high advantage. He was looking for an opening there. Aiden yeah. moving his head nicely. I think he got yeah, him in. A bit aggressive and then that's it. What's happening there? Now, uh, I just dropped him and just seen it went for it. I wish that a little bit. Did you want to be in that full man position or? Uh, yeah, really. Pretty much. Yeah. Now I'm not sure if you're going to take the step pro one day, but obviously this was pro. Yeah. You're in a bit of a dominant position. Dominant position on the ground. Yeah, of course. In the, in the semi-pro with no headshots on the floor, then this does give... Uh... It's funny as well, when I had him here, he was screaming. Uh, <laughs> 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 and then work something. At this stage, had you thought, I've won this? Well, I thought, you know, yeah, see what happens from here, you know, I'm in the dominant position. What were you, gonna, what were you doing here, putting, trying to put the knee over? Yeah, I was going to go for the triangle there, and then I seen it, and you have my leg there, so I thought, you know, why not go for the leg? And how happy were you at this point? Yeah, I wish I did do this, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> what was the smack in the face all about? I don't know, I mean... I did that WTKA, I had three fights in that, uh -huh. and uh, I've had uh, one amateur fight and one certain profile, and I ain't been hitting anyone. So, uh, pretty. Obviously, you put a lot of work, and obviously, we came down with film, and when we did some of the trailers, we saw that you did put a lot of work into your training. Is there anything you want to say to your coaches and to your people out there watching me? Well, definitely thank to all the Leicester Shoot Fighters, you know, big thank you to Nathan Hilton. I couldn't have got the awesome slick submission about him. Uh, big thanks to my brother Andre H for working on my boxing a little bit more, you know, making it more crisp. Uh, Alan Brown and Chris McKenna for you know, boxing on Saturdays. Thanks to all the less shoot fighters, really. Okay, well, um, thank you to Aiden and submission on the night. Congratulations. Cheers. Thank you. Let's hear from Fantastic Europe, let's hear from Jamie Stoop-Hedier.